guys so I'm back and I really hope you guys can see everything so I'm doing a seafood mukbang again and this time I have crab legs um, shrimp lobster tails some mussels and some clams and broccoli and you know all the good stuff I'm recording off my phone because I just wanted to see like what would happen if it would look good or whatever I feel like the frame is mad small but Anywho, and I have my Minute Maid Lemonade, and I don't think I have a story time. I'm probably just going to, like, talk and eat. I don't have anything specific I think I want to talk about. Oh, and I have, like, some, some butter. Yep. I've been really wanting seafood lately but I think it's because I've been watching other people's mukbangs I'm like ugh I can't wait to have some seafood let me get in a bag if they want to show them Maybe I can. Mm, I'll do it different now. My glasses are steaming up because it's hot. It tastes really good. Everything. And a piece of broccoli. And the snow crabs. Got the spice on them. Else, like second to season all first Did anybody watch the last video I did about me almost going to jail or getting arrested? The last mukbang, the Indian food one. I was too hungry in that one. But how about that night? Well, that night when I went to bed, I had a dream that I talked to that girl. And that... She, um, she contacted me. Well, this was my dream that she contacted me. But. Mm -mm. The dream was weird. There was a lot of mixed messages happening in that dream. Mm -mm. I think she wrote me a letter. And like. Came to my mom's house and taped it to the door. But I don't know what the letter was saying. I think I didn't care in a dream either. Like, keep your letter, miss. I don't want it. Okay. 
but a shell just fell. Oh, I'm just gonna kick my butt. Sorry, mom. I'll pick it up. When I find it, somewhere. It's spicy. Do anybody prefer a certain kind of crab over another? I know one YouTuber said she preferred the blue crab. But I really like Dungeonese. But today I got snow. Just love the time I think I had Dungeonese. And Dejanese are like a softer shell crab. And I think they're sweeter. They're starting to fall apart. I'm trying to dig it out in one piece for y'all. You know what I've never had? It's a place I go to. They don't sell it. Or at least I've never seen them sell it. The King Crab Lake. And I really want to try that. Is it like a snow crab? But I'm just trying to figure out like the flip. I guess the, the taste of it. <clears throat> You know, either it's sweet or like salty. Let's see if it'll come out in one piece. Yep. some season on it. I'd have a greasy chin. I also have some mussels. Let me get some mussels. Anybody like mussels? I love mussels. I know they're not too attractive looking, I guess, but 
Ach gut. Excuse me. Mm. One juicy one. Mm. And clam. I love clams. I always have. Mm. Clams are a little bit more chewier than um mussels. I ba <clears throat> I barely see anyone eat um with their shrimp like tartar sauce I guess it's all about the batter huh Pretty long, right? A lot of meat. Mm. You gotta pull that shell apart and get all the meat. Nose running a little bit. Lobster tail. <clears throat> Let's see. That's the only thing I hate about these is like cracking them. 
I'm always scared I'm going to cut myself. Sometimes I do. And I dig out the meat from like the sides. never happens to me. And lobster is a bit chewy too. For people who don't, who like have allergies but really like, like to watch these and stuff. Because they just probably really want to eat seafood. Oh man, I'm just Anytime I meet people who can't, I'm like, man, I'm so sorry. Because it's so good. I would be so sad if I ever had a seafood allergy. If I woke up one day and was just allergic to it, I would be really sad. messy job My chin shiny. I mostly have friends who are, well, not mostly, I'm just saying, like, I don't really have any friends that are like, oh, seafood. I don't like seafood. I only know one person who's like that. One. That's my dad. He hates it. He hates the smell of seafood. And everyone in my mom's house, they eat seafood, like, often, too. So he just hates the smell. <sighs> Sorry. It's <clears throat> spicy.
oil. It's like popping everywhere with the garlic. <clears throat> I can tell you guys right now, I'm not going to finish this whole platter. <laughs> but I'm going to try to eat as much crab and shrimp. Oh, that kind uh, excuse me. At first I was like, mmm, mmm. I'm gonna really try not to burp on camera. I can't help it. And a lot of you guys like the burping. I get it. It's like satisfaction. Like, who is good? Burp. That's why I use one of my dad's old t-shirts to eat. Because y'all already know. It gets, gets messy. When you're eating seafood, you cannot come to play. I mean, you'll be ready. And get your hands dirty. Because you can't be cute eating it. There's no way. I tried. I think it's one of those things if you don't eat it like you mean it, you know, it just tastes better. <laughs> You enjoy yourself a lot more. Ooh. What is like crab meat? I have another one in here. Mm -hmm. That was good. Nope. <laughs> you know who I want to see? Um... Do a seafood mukbang. I'm not sure if she did one, but I watch a lot of hers. I think her thing is like chunky monkey or something like that. Eating chunky junky monkey, something. Like she says it and it's so cute. I can't remember her name right now, but I don't think I've ever seen her eat like crab legs or nothing. But she um. I've said I've seen her eat a lot of sushi. 
and she just makes it look so good. She's one of my favorites too. My best friend is gonna take my butt. She's like, I'm slurping again. I know, sorry. It just be good, girl. She be the same way though. We in private. We're ugly with it, both of us. Like, Anybody else have family members that don't like seafood? I will say things about it. As if you're now going to stop liking it. My dad. He's like. I'm like it's the most disgusting. <laughs> My dad's a picky eater. He never grew out of it. Just picky eating. Like, um, my son is a picky eater too. But that has a lot to do with his autism. But he eats more, he'll try different, more different foods. That's because he has no choice living with me. Maybe even his parents, he has no choice but to try different foods. Um, but he'll eat more things than my dad. Like, I'm like, bro. Tell my dad all the time, you're such a baby, you're such a little kid. I call him a toddler. I'm not eating that. I call him a toddler. But my dad... He encourages my son to try different foods because, you know, he's like, I don't want him to be like, like me and miss out on things. Um, you know, but after a couple of attempts, I can probably get my son to at least try something to so try it. And then he'll be like, not too bad. I think it's so cute. I got so much food left, you guys. It's no way I'm gonna finish it all. The video hit it hit 30 minutes so far. So I'm gonna try to finish. I'm gonna try to finish these for you. And then we'll wrap it up. Mm -hmm.
the thing about seafood is you can eat a lot of it. Only in like two hours you'll be hungry again. Well, at least that happens to me. I'm like, oh my god. I feel hungry again. Not Maybe not two hours, but... I don't know. It was a quick fix and then you'll be hungry again. We like it when it comes out whole, right? And thank you guys so much for people who like give me such good support and feedback on the videos. I really appreciate you guys. You guys are super sweet. I found another clam. Yeah, I appreciate you guys. And I think I'm subscribed to all of you guys' channels. And I do watch. Oh. <laughs> 